Hi, I'm Lucas Clawson, historian at Hagley Museum and Library, and this is Hagley from Home. How often do you think about some of the everyday objects that are in your house? Things that are around your kitchen, things you encounter every day, appliances, other little doodads, thingamajigs. Where do they come from? How did they come to be? That's one of the things that you can research in our collections here at Hagley. The items that are on the table in front of me are from the collection of an industrial designer named Marshall Johnson. He worked for Procter Silex, wherever a couple of companies that did you probably heard of designing things like these irons. And not only the objects themselves, but something that you probably really don't think about, but the boxes and containers that some of these things come in. That this is all the product of careful thought, you know, that somebody has to sit down and put all this together, and that's one of the things that Marshall did. A strength of this collection is that we have everything from his correspondence to design drawings to prototype models, all sorts of things that show you the process from beginning to end. And even some of the really neat things that we have are items like this. It's called a demonstrator model. It's made clear so that you could see inside, see how it's all put together, demonstrate how something operates. So this is a can opener, and here is the finished product. That way you can see the demonstrator model, you can see the final thing, and even the box that it came in, which is all part of the awesome stuff you can research here in the library at Hagley.